Hey guys, it's Crystal. So today I wanted to do a what's in my toddler's travel bag. We're going to be traveling to Japan for three weeks to visit family and stuff. So um, yeah, I just wanted to share what I am packing my toddler in our bag. Um, she is not going to be carrying her own bag. I'm going to go ahead and carry just my regular sports backpack that I have just in here and yeah <laughs> let's get started so the first thing I have is a wet bag I cloth diapers so I have lots of wet bags for cloth diapers but I'm actually taking this one it's a Planet Wise wet bag see it has a PUL lining so if it's wet, it won't go through. So I'm taking this just in case we have any accidents, you know, anything can happen in a plane. So if anything gets wet or dirty, it will go in here. Next, I'm taking some clothes. Mind you, these are probably not the clothes she's going to be wearing, but I did a test run on what I was packing. So, um, but I am taking this. I'm taking a, it's a little swaddle muslin swaddle muslin blanket so I'm taking that for her it's really big and thin but that's what she's going to use I'm actually taking a extra shirt for me mine's a maternity shirt because I am 20 well soon to be 22 weeks pregnant so take an extra shirt for me um, a shirt for her and some pants and her PJs um, let's see. As far as snacks go, I am taking a bunch of squeegees, varieties, um, some cheese crackers, and probably pack some more cheese crackers and other little snacks here and there. So that's all her snacks. Our flight is not direct flight, so we're heading, um, We'll be traveling in two different planes, so I have enough for both trips. I also have some disposable bibs, so I can just toss these if they get soiled. I actually got those at the dollar store. Real inexpensive. I'll list everything below so that way y'all know where I got things. <clears throat> My husband bought her her own earphones, and I don't know the brand of these. I have to ask my husband, but they're really cute. They're for her size, they actually fit me pretty well. But yeah, so she has her own earphones just in case she wants to see anything on the plane or play the games on there that they have on the screen. Now, as far as activity goes, I have a lot of different activities for her to keep her busy. I want to try and keep her as busy as po much as possible. I am trying to avoid a screaming toddler, which, of course, is no guarantee. So, I have a couple of books for her. She hasn't seen some of these things just because I want her to see something new and that way she's more engaged with it. So I would keep that in mind if you are packing things. Get some new books and toys just to pack that your toddler hasn't seen just so that they're more engaged to it and keeps them a little bit more busy. So yeah, I got her a book, some counting books. I think she had this one, but she doesn't really look at it too often. Little peekaboo books. I have a coloring book because she loves to color. And she's really into coloring and stickers and stuff. So I got her one of these. Little pack and play. You can get these at the dollar store or even Target. And some more little colors and stickers and another little coloring book that's inside. Um, this is another coloring activity. It's a marker that only writes on this paper. 
So, and I got her some of those. Don't mind the dog. Got her stickers because she loves stickers. So, bunch and bunch of stickers to keep her busy. I got her, I guess you call it like an etch a sketch. Not an etch a sketch. A magna doodle. A little magna doodle just for her. She's seen this before, but I, like I said, I've had everything packed away. So that way she doesn't play with it or know that it exists. <laughs> um, I actually got her her own little notebook and pen because she just is obsessed with writing stuff and drawing circles in my notepad. So I got her her very own blank empty notepad that she can write all over. I got her some crayons, just a brand new box of crayons. I got her some little toys, again from the dollar store. And I also got her some extra stickers and coloring books and another set of books that I will um, pack when we're coming back. So it'll be something totally different on the way back over. But we're going to put those in my suitcase where she can't get to it. Okay, and next thing that I have here is my um, first aid kits, um, hand sanitizers, and whatnot. Um, so what I have in here is if she gets dehydrated or gets sick, I got her these little, they're electric light powder. It's like Pedialyte kind of, but you just put it in the water and you're good to go. So packing a bunch of these just in case she gets sick. Packing some Tylenol. Probably going to take a smaller one because I think this might be too big for the plane. Got a to-go. Neosporin. These are antibacterial wipes, hand wipes. A little syringe thing for her Tylenol. Tissues. Taking two tissues because mama tends to need tissues. And an actual first aid kit which has band-aids and gauze and cleansing wipes. So that is all her little safety medicine kit packed in. Hopefully I won't have to use any of the medicine stuff and she stays nice and healthy during the whole trip. Which would be great. And I also have disposable bags for, you know, soil pull-ups because we aren't potty trained fully yet. So disposable for so trash bags for any disposable stuff that needs to be thrown away. And I also have hand sanitizer. Very important since there's stuff going around right now. If you know what I mean. And last but not least pull up because like I said not fully potty trained so definitely have to wear some pull ups and that's pretty much it for my toddler and her stuff for the airplane um, for me like I said I'm just taking a shirt extra shirt of course my wallet and um, Probably my earphones, just in case, which I doubt it I'm ever going to use it. This toddler's probably going to keep me super busy for me to actually sit down and listen to anything. <laughs> so, main concern is for her to be super entertained and busy on the plane so we can avoid any toddler meltdowns, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty much it. what I'm packing in my backpack for my toddler. If any of you have any suggestions on what else to take, or maybe what not to take, um, please feel free to leave a, a comment below. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed this little video, something a little different. I'm probably going to make another video 
when we return from Japan and tell you what worked and what didn't work for us um, as far as in, in the airplane goes and how our experience went this time around with a two-year-old compared to when we went when she was six, seven months. So yeah, definitely look out for that video. Probably be out around November. Um, so yeah, and that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed it and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!